Welcome back to The Guru. Today I'm going to show you how to create a company organizational chart. So usually the methods for creating these involve programs where you drag and drop different boxes onto a document and then you connect them with v different types of connector lines. Whereas this way in Google Sheets I think is a lot easier. All you do is in the left column you make a list of all your employees. And then in the right column you just write who manages that employee. It doesn't matter the order that these are in as long as those two things match up. So for instance, right now, the CEO and the higher positions are up here at the top. But if I were to put CEO as an employee over here and his manager as investors, that would still be sorted out and it would recognize that the investors are above the CEO over here. So right now, this isn't much of an organizational chart. So what you do is you highlight all of this, go to Insert, and then go to Chart. And then we go to Chart Types, and we uncheck all of these boxes, and scroll down, and click Organizational Chart. Then we'll click Insert. And voila, there is our org chart that maps this all out. And we can change this in the spreadsheet, and it will automatically update this chart as well. So let's say that we add someone under sales systems, which is a salesperson. Now it added the salesperson under sales systems. So that's really all there is to it. I hope this saves you a lot of time while making org structures, and it can also help for mapping out things like folder hierarchies and things like that. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them in the comment section below. Thank you, and have a great day.